Hey everyone, it's John from eWatchBox. Today we're going to review the Cub Single Winder Module 1.8 manufactured by Wolf Designs. Now when you get your Cub Winder, it's going to come in a box that looks something like this. On the box is the Wolf uh, Design logo. It's in a nice sturdy cardboard box for shipping purposes. And you'll notice here uh, comes with the style number with a serial number that is unique to this um, that's unique to the winder itself. You can see here 72196. This also ends in 72196. You'll want to keep those uh, stickers as they mean something from a registration purpose. Okay? When it comes time to register in your winder for warranty purposes. Alright, as you can see, this is a, a fairly uh, classy winder. Um, it's made of faux leather. This one's the black um, with kind of a fabric-y front. And then again the faux leather. And then here on the back you can see a uh, power port for your power plug and then this is your on and off switch. And then here on the underside you'll see a, um, a cover that reveals uh, two AA batteries so that you can power this thing um, with battery power so you don't have to have an electric or electric outlet. Okay. Again, this is a pretty simple winder. Really easy to get the watch on the pillow. Matter of uh, pressing in these two clasps here and the pillow comes right out. And then mounting the watch is pretty simple. Slide this back just a bit. And you're going to place your watch over the pillow. And then what it does is it actually squishes together where you would then clasp the watch onto the pillow front and then you'd place it oops let go of that here get on there buddy okay so now that I've got my watch on the pillow place it in the cubby hole and then it's ready to be wound okay now, powering the winder is pretty easy. comes with a 110 or a 240 volt adapter, depending upon which country you live in. It's just a matter of plugging the power into the back of the winder and then turning the winder itself on. Now, this winder only has one TPD or turns per day setting and it's set to 900 rotations per day. Uh, it's not going to rotate them all at once, but periodically throughout the day it's going to pause or it's going to sleep. Uh, then it's going to wake up and then it's going to turn for a number of turns. Uh, and it's going to do that all throughout the day until it has reached the 900. Uh, after which um, it'll pause, sleep, and then it'll start uh, the day over um, rotating 900 rotations. Okay. Now the unique thing about this winder is, again, you might start out with one automatic watch that needs to be wound. You might start out with two watches. Then you might decide to go out and pick out another uh, third watch. And you don't want to have to throw this winder away uh, just so you can buy a triple watch winder. So uh, Wolf has done something kind of unique, kind of uh, neat, and that is, is they've made these so that they can be modularized or stackable. You can add more components uh, to the winder as you add to your watch collection. Okay, and that's really simple. I'm going to turn the power off, unplug it, and then I'm going to get another winder here. So you see I've got my second winder. And then this little adapter right here, well, if you can see it, this little adapter right here actually takes one power connection and splits it to two. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to plug my power connection, my splitter, into the into the adapter that's plugged into the wall. Then I'm actually going to plug my first winder just like that into the back and then I'm going to plug my second winder into the ad other adapter. Then I'm going to turn them both on. 
I'm going to turn them around and you can see that both winders are powered by the single outlet. Okay, again, it just means that you don't have to have two plugs into the wall to power two different watch winders. Now, another accessory that can be added on, and I don't have a picture of it today, uh, is a cubby. Uh, and what that cubby will allow you to do is it will allow you to stack um, into one single unit three different winders so that it appears it gives the appearance of us of a single uh, winder with three different heads on it okay again you can see the green flashing light indicates that the power is on uh, just because the, the light is flashing green doesn't mean that the uh, the heads gonna rotate again it will pause and sleep uh, periodically throughout the day to simulate the rotation of your wrist okay now Something else that's really neat that comes with this particular winder is, again, I talked about a 110 or a 240 volt. There are a number of different connections that come with the winder. So you don't have to worry about running out to buy uh, another adapter if you're going to travel uh, to a different country. And I'll show you how these things work with the adapter that comes. Okay. So these are the three units that come with the cub winder. Okay, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to turn these around, I'm going to power them off. I'm going to unplug the power, unplug these units from the power, and I'm going to show you the actual end of the adapter that comes. Okay, and so you can see here this adapter has the uh, 110 outlet on it, but if you push this, let me push here. I'm having a hard time here. This will actually just slide out, okay? And you can slide on the different outlet that you need, okay? And it snaps into place. And again, push down here, and you just slide it off and you're able to plug in the adapter unit that's appropriate uh, for your power source depending upon where you're at. Okay, pretty simple, pretty straightforward, kind of unique. Again, it just means you don't have to have a, a big clunky uh, outlet that you, that you carry around. You know, you can just, hey, I'm going to go to this country, so I'm just going to take this particular adapter here, uh, and that's all you need to have. Again, this is the Cub Single Winder Module 1.8 by Wolf Designs. If you have any questions, uh, email me at sales at ewatchbox.com. Again, that's sales at ewatchbox.com. Uh, feel free to check us out at ewatchbox.com on the internet.